Make use of this water to open your spiritual eyes naturally. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for stopping by. If you are new here for the first time, you are so welcome. My name is Pamela. So in this channel, I share spiritual tips and messages. Spiritual tips that will be a blessing to you. You are doing it rightly, follow the instructions. By the grace of God, things are shared. Anything you do rightly with your faith must surely work for you. If you love spiritual tips, go on and subscribe. Turn on the bell so that whenever I upload videos, you get notified and come and watch. So I'm going to show you how to use coconut water to open your spiritual eyes naturally. So this is a spiritual tip that will help you greatly. So I don't do spiritual work for people. Outside this, I don't do spiritual work. So you have to beware of those claiming to be me. Anybody trying to scam you, saying that you should bring money to do spiritual work for you, write on the comment section or using my image, using my name to claim that, that they are me. To scam one, I'm not the one. Before you pay, please ask for video call or voice call. You see that they will run. So there are different ways to open your spiritual eyes, to start seeing things, to start seeing those things that God wants you to see, to start seeing things that will help people and help yourself, to start seeing when trouble is about to come, to start seeing when good things are about to come. So this is not in a way of making you to be afraid or any way. Even if you see vision by your neighbor, do not hide it okay if you have this gift you don't need to hide it because you will just indirectly make god very angry so in case you start seeing things and your mind tells you not to use it for money not to use it for business stick to it except you want to just start using it for business if you see vision for someone and someone just like from his own heart give you something or give you a gift that one is different god will open your eyes to start seeing so many things this is purely natural if you want to do it in a godly way either you do it with prayers you pray seriously embark in spiritual welfare or you use those things created by god like using coconut water i'm going to tell you what to add with coconut water to open your spiritual eyes your third eye when you open that your third eye, you will just stay like this, you'll be seeing things. You will stay like this, you'll be seeing things that are yet to come. When trouble wants to come, you will see it. That first thing that will come to your mind, that is the vision. So I'm not just saying the one that you just stay like this, you'll be thinking. No, thinking is totally different. So when you are there, you will understand what I'm saying. So when God opens your spiritual eyes, your third eyes, Make sure you stick to those things that pleases God because you will surely lose this gift. You will lose it. If God opens your spiritual eyes, make sure your hands are clean. Anything you are doing, make sure it pleases God. If, for example, you have issue with somebody, please try to make peace before the next day, no matter how. I know we are all human. So let me just go into this. I'm just trying to tell you things that will make, that will make it permanent. So get three coconuts, like this is one, okay? Every one of it carries enough water. There are some that has few water in it, no problem. But make sure you get three. It must be from three coconuts. Get that coconut, and if you are fortunate to get this one that have these three eyes, one, two, three, fine, okay? So just get it like three of it. So if you find the one that is immature, the one that is not so mature like this, better. Very better. I don't know whether you understand me. The coconut that is not so mature. You know, when you break it open, you see that the fruit, the white fruit is so strong. Not the one I mean. The one that is immature, that has not reached to it. That is the one you should get. Three of it, please. It will look like this, but it's not that mature, okay? So get three of it, then you have to break it open. Transfer the, three, the, uh, the water into a bowl. Any plastic bowl, any bowl at all, but not in a black bowl. Do not transfer it in a black bucket or a black bowl. As you have transferred the water from three coconuts, then the next thing you have to do is to get honey. Please try to use original honey, okay? There are some people that will say they have tried that it's not working. Where did you get those items? Where you got them is very important. Anytime you are doing spiritual work, try to get original ones. So transfer about just 
about half tablespoon or one full tablespoon of honey into that coconut water and mix it. You can use your hand, you can use anything to mix it up. Then when you are done, you have to transfer a little salt, just a pinch of salt, even if it's just a little like this, transfer it into that water. So we have now coconut water, we have honey, and we have salt. These three can do great things for you. So after that, you have to go outside, keep it outside. Let that money do, that do in the morning. You need it, you need it in the spiritual work. Just keep that water outside till the next day. In the morning, maybe after that, seven o'clock, eight o'clock, you have to bring that water out. Use this water to wash your face. As you are washing your face, you have to be praying. Of course, you know what you want. You want God to open your spiritual eyes, your third eye. Be praying as you are doing so. But before you keep it outside, make sure you pray seriously that night. Tell God to have mercy upon you, that you want this for him. As you make it of that water that you want to keep outside, that I want your eyes to be open, that I want to start seeing things, that I want to help people, that I want to help yourself, that I want him to show you great things, that you promise not to do things that does not please him. Okay? If you see that, it's going to excite God, and you see that this is going to work greatly for you. So the next morning, when you are sure that it's ready, Okay, then you have to use it to wash your face. You can wash your face with it in the house or outside, anyone. As you are washing your eyes, okay, you have to be praying. Do not tight it like this. As you are washing it, ensure that some enters around your eyes. I'm not saying you should be pouring it directly like this. You will be washing your, your face with it like this. Be opening your eyes. Make sure that here is wet. Okay, do not just tight it like this. So when you are done, pray seriously and believe that this is going to work greatly. Please do not use the whole water. You can transfer it in a can to use it next time. You can do this every morning. Every morning, bring out that can. Transfer some amount of water. Wash your face. Every morning, you can do it every morning if you want to. As you are washing your face with this water, you have to be praying and thanking God. Some people, immediately after doing this, they will start seeing things. Please, when you are seeing things like I told you, use it to bless people. Use it to also help people around you by telling them what you saw. Whether they believe you or not. By the grace of God, things you ask for will be granted. God will open your spiritual eyes and this is not fetish, okay? This is godly. Do it yourself and you see the Spirit of God flowing in and being a blessing to you. Thank you so much for watching. Remember to subscribe, share this video to everyone. Remain blessed as always. I will see you in my next video.